Hello YouTubers, thanks for watching. Today we're going to be marinating pork chops and I like to marinate my pork chops 24 hours or overnight. So the key ingredients are of course pork chops, soy sauce, lemon, banana ketchup, this is sugar right here, garlic, fresh garlic's a lot better but right now I don't have fresh garlic, so I have the minced garlic and pepper. And ground peppers are better as well, but I like this. And what we're going to be doing is putting them all together. This is about one to two, uh, about a cup and a half of soy sauce. And the banana ketchup, normally you want to put half, but this is a strong soy sauce I have. So I'm going to put about almost a cup of banana ketchup. Let me blend it in there. And the lemon. Now I cut one and a half of lemon. Depending on how much you want to taste. If you want it um, acidic, you want to put more. And it's okay if you have the lemon seed in there. Which is a lot of lemon seed. Okay, and you wanna mix it up. And add about a tablespoon of sugar. The banana ketchup is already sweet. And you're going to add garlic. Again, fresh garlics are best, but I don't have the fresh garlic available and peppers. And depending on how spicy you want it, then add as you go. And you just want to stir it. And all you got to do is pour it in into your mix. I'm sorry into the pork chops and you just want to lift your pork chops a little bit so everything is marinated just like so alrighty and what we're gonna do is seal it up with saran wrap and refrigerate it for 24 hours or overnight. Okay, medium heat, I'm gonna go ahead and check. It's been three minutes since I placed it on. I'm just going to check underneath to see if I like the color. And I like mine charred. So right now I'm going to go ahead and flip, but I'm gonna go ahead and spread the oil a little bit. And then cook it for another three minutes. Depending on the thickness of your pork chop, you see how thick your pork chop is? You might want to have to time it and check and make sure if it's cooked enough for you. In the same pan that we cooked the pork chops on, we're going to cook the onions. What I did was I removed the charred parts out of the pan, most of it at least, and still kept the same oil. And I'm going to add a little bit of that marinade that we used to soak the pork chop on. What I want to do is just cook it medium rare. And just mix it in. And what you just want to do is have the soy sauce blend in with the onion. And you want to cook it on high for a good 
minute and then release it. And you could just use it as a topping for your pork chop. Voila! Okay, I'm going to cut it just to see how it is inside. Nice and soft. Perfect, perfect. And put it this way, nice and perfect. I hope you guys enjoyed it, watching the video. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.